Okay, I made a bet with my friend Marcus Osborne that Iggy Azalea would win Best Rap Song of the Year. She lost. Rap album. She lost to Eminem, which I think is a shocker. But the bottom line is, I feel Iggy Azalea was robbed because of a racist element that says, oh, hey, you, um, you know what? She's appropriating black culture. Look, I'm 52. I go back to a time when if someone used the term Mark and then someone white used it, it was like, hey, you're taking black culture. This has been going on for generations. It's a hallmark of American society. But here, think about the flip side of it. If someone like me talked the way that I did in the 60s and 70s, we were called white. If we were, were the most intelligent person in the room, we were called white, as if a black person could not possibly be that smart at all. Further, there are people like the late Dr. William Shockley that took unusual links to prove that blacks are less intelligent than whites. So the reason why I fight so hard in the other direction is because you don't think logically about the reverse, okay? The bottom line is Iggy Azalea has gone a long way toward making what you and I identify as black culture mainstream, but she has a right to do that as someone who is white. And as a black person, you shouldn't need to have those signals to know that you're black. That has to stop. Marcus, dinner's on me. We can talk more. And Iggy Azalea was robbed by the racists.